explained the procedure to the mannequin, speaking clearly, slowly, and directly. Put on clean gloves before washing the perineal area. Before you begin washing, check the temperature of the water and ask the client or the mannequin to verify the temperature of the water. You want to make sure it's not too hot. You'll use a larger cloth as a bed liner and you can place it alongside of the mannequin as you ask the mannequin or turn the mannequin over in order to place the bed liner underneath her buttocks. Then you can roll her over and expose only an area between the hips and knees. You can begin by applying soap to a wet washcloth. As you wash the genital area, make sure you move from the front to the back, and when you're done, immediately dispose of it. Using a clean washcloth with rinse water only, rinse the soap from the genital area. Move in a front to back motion. Now dry the genital area using the same technique. After you're done, put the bed sheets back on the client and turn her to her side. You can now begin washing the rectal area. Using a clean washcloth, Apply soap and wet the washcloth. As you can see, I'm rinsing and washing and drying the rectal area only. I'm still using a front to back motion. And I'm not cleaning more than I have to. Before you turn the patient over onto her side, remove the bed linen and dispose of it, and then reposition the patient. Take out your dirty supplies and proceed to the sink. You can stop on your way to the sink at the designated dirty supply area and place the soap. 